name is Luis Dentinho. This is my friend and student Duke. Today I'd like to show three swim missions from side control. It's gonna be the first one, Kimura, second one, straight time lock, third one, paper cutter choke. So just pay attention guys on the details, okay? So let's start here on the side control. So side control, I talked about this before. I want you to keep his off your shoulder on the ground, okay? So here, that's why I go on the hook and don't go over. So I control him. Let's talk about this frame today, okay, on this technique. So right here, if my knee facing up, he has room to push and then create a space to, to move his hip out. If my opponent have this elbow down and then like he's pushing my hip, I'm going to drop my knee to the ground. Go push right now. Right now he cannot push. If my knee's up, he can push. Okay? So make sure your knee's down. These are. Some people like not south. <coughs> not south, you guys, are very like a like a, a special moment to go. If his arms are on my neck, if I go to not south, he can swim his arm under my under my armpit on facing up, yes. As I'm going to not south, he can come and grab my leg. If his arm is around my 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 head, I don't go to not south. If he make a frame, is when I can go to not south. Okay? But today, let's talk about when his arm is around the head. He's bothering me with, with this arm, okay? So I drop the knee. If his elbow is up on my hip, right here, I cannot drop the knee, but I can go under, okay? Today's case, his elbow is down. So I'm going to drop my knee, toes and heel on the ground, try to push. Right now he cannot. So he look, two arms against one. I'm going to use a free arm to to bring him to me and then make him be sideways. From here, I'm going to push his head and then step over. Right now, guys, I'm facing toward his leg. The reason this knee is up is because if he wants to defend his arm, number one, he's gonna try to put his back flat on the ground, okay? So that's why my knee is facing toward him and then toes on the ground. Number two, he's gonna try to bring his arm down, okay? So here, if I'm going to Kimura, I'm going to sit back. If I sit forward, okay, I don't have balance. So keep the weight back, go. Right now, I, I'm gonna be much stronger than him. The free arm, same side, my knees up. I'm going to hug his arm, and then I bring to me. Control, bring. Control the wrist, and then now look, I control my wrist. Now my elbow, I'm going to bring my elbow toward his lower back. And then I sit right here, facing toward his head right now. The leg over the head. If I take the leg over the head, he can sit up. So right here, look, I need my leg over. Try to sit up. Right now, he cannot. He's when I can apply the Kimura shoulder lock. The other option, again, is bring right here, knee down, heavy, push. My weight is back. Right here. In the first option, he tried just a little bit again, then he give up. If he keep like fighting, okay guys, to bring his elbow, to, to bring his hand down, if I go to Kimura, I can lose. So right here, look, I'm going to bring my, 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 my body back so I, so I can pass this leg over. Go fight, please. Right here, guys, if I bring my body back, this leg is going to be easy to pass. Going to straight down. The last option is going to be the, 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 the choke. If he too strong, then he make a grip with his belt, pants or gear, okay, doesn't matter. So I'm going here, same thing, knee down, push, step over. My weight is always back, but, but like, let's say he's too strong, boom, he dropped the hand. I'm going to switch, just like Kimura grip. Okay, right here, switch. Now I'm going to grab his gi, okay? Gi, lapel, anything to pass over his hand right here. And then I make a grip, palm facing down, holding. Right now, he's not able to take his hand out anymore. I'm going to rotate toward his back, and I'm going to put my leg behind his head. The reason I put my leg right here, he should make a better grip, okay, the paper cutter choke. So here, look, I'm going to make a grip, turn in. Now, if, if my elbow is out, I'm going to choke him right here. 
This part of, of his neck is too strong. I want you to go right here, guys, on the hold of his neck. Always, guys, paper cutter choke, don't choke right here, choke right here. So look, I make a grip, elbow out. Once I'm ready to choke him, bring the elbow in, okay? I want my hand on the, on the hold of his neck. Now I can take my knee out, put his back to the ground. I drive, then I can choke. So right here, look, this hold, doesn't matter how, how strong his neck are, I, I will be able to choke him. Right here, he can resist a lot. Right here, he don't resist, okay? Guys, thank you very much. I hope you guys enjoyed all the videos. And uh, don't forget, guys, subscribe my channel, like, share with your friends, and uh, also I have an Instagram, the Team Brazilian Jiu Jitsu. Okay, I keep posting like pictures and, and some rolls over there. Okay, thank you. Peace.